morning and welcome back with me again so that you can hear my thoughts that I've been thinking of. Why do I keep on praying? Why? Why bother? Well, simply put, I pray because I'm weak. I'm, I'm weak in everything in my life. My mind, the things I think. My body's weak. I'm growing old. The gray hairs are showing it. I'm weak with the things I do because sometimes I do the things that are selfish and prideful and and then anxieties. I think I have control over everything. Anxieties that when things don't go my way and the plans that I make, they all crumble. I'm weak. So I pray because God is my strength. He's my strength. The Word of God says over and over again that God is perfect in every way. He's perfect in everything He does. I cling to the Bible and His Word that it's His strength that gets me through the hurdles of my life. In Jeremiah, it says that God has the plans for my life. Bonnie doesn't have control over plans. A lot of the plans that I made this week just, just didn't happen. Why? Because it wasn't my plans, it's his plans. It says in the Bible that God can move mountains. Do you believe that? I've had so many mountains in my life. Mountains. It's not mountains of climbing. It's mountains in my life. The hurdles of life. But when I pray, there is strength in Him. There's strength. He is the living God. He sent his only son to this earth to die for me, to show me that he's the only way to live my life with him and me. And Jesus died, but he rose again. He's alive. All those promises of the Old Testament came true in the New Testament. So it's God's word that is true that I cling to. And I pray every morning. I murmur talking to God. I give it back. I give it back. The things that I can't control. The things of my mind when I start to think the things that I shouldn't be thinking. The guilt. As moms and grandmas, we feel guilty all the time. And that's wrong. That's wrong. That's my. That's me wanting control. And I pray. I always pray. God, take control over those things. I can't change. The world is in a calamity. Like it's like never before. Nothing is the same. And I don't think anything will be the same again. But I know that one thing that God always stays the same. So I pray, I pray constantly to this perfect God who is my strength. He made me, he allowed me to grow in my mother's womb. He knew he wanted Bonnie in this world. I don't understand it, but he does. And I know that he put you in this world for his purposes. Why do I pray? Because in his strength, I'm strong. He is perfect. Even if I don't understand it, I give it all to him constantly, constantly. The things I cannot change. God says, 
nothing is impossible with him. So I pray according to that. There has been things in my life that I've questioned at the time, important people in my life that have died, important people in my life that have stumbled in their marriages, in their jobs, in their um, inadequacies, in their struggles with disease. And I can't do anything. God can. He has a purpose. You know what? I'm 68 years old and I have learned in those years to depend. I look, depend on him. I look back on my life and see the things that I prayed for and then I go, I look back and I go, aha, God, you were in that. You had a plan that I didn't understand. So I pray today. I pray all through the day. And prayer is just talking. Lord, I need you. Every hour I need you. The things I can't do, you can do your way. I trust in you. I pray that this is encouraging to you today. I have to keep reminding myself every day because there's a battle. There's a battle that goes on with us because we think we're in control. The enemy doesn't like us talking to God, so he will throw stuff in your face constantly. But in it says in the word of God, in his strength, things are made perfect according to him he is my strength when i am weak he is my all in all once again i i pray that you be encouraged today whatever you're going through whatever i don't know it's early in the day i don't know what's going to happen today but i trust that I will cling to God's word. I have to be in his word every day and, and clinging to those verses that um, strengthen me and my faith with him. So God bless and have a great day. And um, you know what? I'm praying for you. So God bless.